Hi everyone and welcome to the review of the Caledonian Sleeper. It is a review that has been so long in the planning. I actually cannot believe how long this has been in the planning for. This has been in the planning for just over a year now actually. And it's so nice to finally be reviewing the new train. And today I'm actually lucky enough to be able to review the accessible Caledonian Double, which is just the epitome of luxury in sleeper travel because especially on the Caledonian sleeper you've got everything from literally seats all the way up to like the Caledonian double and then in between you've got um classic rooms and then you've also got club rooms as well so yeah let's take a quick look Caledonian sleeper allows certain passengers access to first class lounges at various principal stations across their network. Predominantly, this is passengers in either the club rooms or the accessible cabins. London Euston and Aberdeen both have disabled toilets with showering facilities within the disabled toilet. However, these stations do not have changing places toilets. So if you require the use of a hoist or changing table, these facilities aren't actually available at those stations. As a wheelchair user, what part of the sleeper you'll be able to access will depend on whether you are in the accessible Caledonian double or if you are in the accessible twin room. As I was in the accessible Caledonian double, I was able to access the club car, the disabled toilet on board and of course my cabin. However, if you're in the accessible twin, you won't be able to access the club car due to the narrowing of the corridor outside the other rooms. So the Caledonian Double is literally like this. There's so much turning space in here for my wheelchair. It's brilliant. And then also you come here. Um, so straight in from the door, which is sliding and automatic, you have the double bed with underbed storage, um, which is perfect for suitcases. You could easily fit two full-size suitcases under there. Uh, lots of floor room for the wheelchair. And then behind us, we have a uh, wash basin and mirror nice little sideboard here i've popped my scarf there you then have this table which actually hang on a second folds out like so so a nice table space there for getting ready and things and then we also um when i came in my key, key card was actually in here um so there's a way that you activate the lock which is you tap the you tap the key card twice and the lock is active, so you just tap in and out when you're going in and out of your room. And then we've also got these gift bags here. So we've got uh, this. Oh, I'm gonna see what's in here. And then, so in here we have Aran toiletries. Oh, lovely. So we have the hand and body lotion, conditioning shampoo and hand and body wash. We also have another goodie bag in here as well with um, some still water. Uh, we have a journey of a nighttime sleep kit, earplugs, eye mask and soap. We then also have more toiletries. <laughs> we have from Aran as well, we have hand and body wash, um, conditioning shampoo there. Pillow spray, that is gonna be so useful for tonight. Uh, another pillow spray. Um, more conditioning shampoo there. 
and then we also have hand and body lotion here on the bed as well is also the room service menu and the accommodation guide so let's take a quick look at these starting with the accommodation guide um which is beautiful so um journey of a night time is actually the um slogan for caledonian sleeper if you didn't know that um so it literally says caledonian sleeper welcome to you on board our new trains for the journey of a night time so if you i will literally just <laughs> i'll run through this quickly so this actually has the rooms actually on here as well and tells you all the um things here so um we've actually got yeah two plugs two usbs here um there's more usbs over that side as well and there's also the thermostat reading lights and the room light and dimmer and then there's also a do not disturb button on there as well um, and then on here is the light switch the door controls help buttons if we need them i also forgot to point out there's a bin there as well <laughs> um just the various uh rules around e-cigarettes and uh, where the toilets are for us the toilets are literally the toilets right outside to the right um the regulations actually mean that they couldn't put the toilet inside the accessible room pardon me so you have the caledonian sleeper on suite um so this is just in the standard rooms and then these are the seat ones And then this actually tells you the features of the train, uh, sweet dreams, tips for getting good sleep. And that's that one done. Um, interestingly as well, I've just remembered this. Um, you've got this blind here, which opens up and down. So if you wanna um, see the views of Scotland in the morning, you can, although it's gonna be really dark because it is November when I'm reviewing this. So uh, yeah. And then the room service menu so breakfast is actually included with the caledonian double um but it and it's also included with club rooms as well for those of you who um watch this but don't need the accessible room but uh room service is chargeable so yeah um and you also have the choice i believe of getting this served in the club car as well and if you're a wheelchair user you get priority access to the club car and um, as you will see there's actually a dedicated wheelchair space as well so these are the options and then here is the drinks menu for those who like a good drink including whiskies i'm glad to see that have they got my favorite on here no there's only one whiskey that i will drink in scotland um and it's really difficult to get hold of and they don't have it on here either so yes and then we have cocktails mixers spirits beer and cider soft drinks and um there we go so that's the room service menu done now just quickly um because i know some of you are going to ask can you at least show the sleep pack pack so i am just going to show it i'm just going to pop this down here so we'll just quickly open this actually because i will end up using this overnight I'll pop that in the bin in a second. <laughs> so, so inside we have um, the earplugs, the sleep mask. This is so cute. It actually has the Caledonian Sleeper logo on it. I love that. That is really pretty. It's really soft as well. And then we have caledonian sleeper soap so that will be going on the sink for when i need to wash my hands there's also the safety information here which um for the train as well which i just realized and then i also have oh that's my ticket reservation
car itself has a space for a wheelchair user should they wish to have breakfast in the club car if you're in the accessible double. The breakfast menu is actually quite extensive. It's a lot more extensive than what I thought it would be. But in the end, I chose the Highland breakfast. Well, that's the end of the review for the Caledonian sleeper. Um, final few thoughts. Um, bear in mind that I also will have, as always, the full blog post coming out as well. So the link for the full blog post will be in the description. But just a couple of quick pointers um, for those of you who are traveling on the Caledonian sleeper in future or who are wanting to. Um, if you require grab rails and things, um, the best place to get changed is in the toilet. Reason being, as you could probably tell, there's actually no grab rails in the bedroom, like in the room itself. Um, it was one thing that I realised this morning when I was trying to get up because I was just like, there's nothing for me to grip onto. Um, so it was a bit of a let's try and, and get up sort of thing, um, just because, you know, I was on a little bit of a bad one with my spasms this morning and if I'm on a good day it's fine but on a bad one I really do need something to be able to just grab onto um so that is one point and then um yeah I mean other than that it's really good the bed is perfect height for transfer I mean it's literally the same height as my chair um in terms of the actual seat and the cushion height um I mean the fact that you've got the table that folds out as well that's really really good um, there's plenty of plug sockets as well um, there's a lot of restrictions on Caledonian sleeper though as to whether you can travel or not but they will be in the full blog post and as I said the link for that is in the description but until the next review take care and see you guys soon bye